overnight. One man is dead, another is wounded after a shooting in Indianapolis. Police say the shooting covers two different crime scenes. News 8's Emily Kenzer is live outside IMPD headquarters explaining all of this. Good morning, Emily. Good morning. The shooting involves two different men and two different crime scenes, and police are still trying to figure out exactly what happened to lead up to that shooting. The first shooting happened. Um, well, the shooting happened inside the Williamsburg East Department complex around 9 o'clock last night. IMPD found a 36 year old man dead inside the apartment. Right now, they believe the man who died shot at the second man who's involved in the shooting. The second man was taken from the scene in a car to 38th and Shadlin area near a White Castle. That's when he was taken by the ambulance to the hospital. We're told he's in serious but stable condition. Police tell us the child was inside during the shooting. Unfortunately, there was a seven year old child inside of the apartment during this violent confrontation. Fortunately, though, the child uh, escaped uninjured. That child now is with an officer, and we are waiting to try and identify a biological mother, a guardian. Uh, and if we're unable to do so, then we'll have to get a hold of Child Protective Services to have the child taken into custody for safekeeping. Police believe they have everyone who was involved in the shooting. Again, the shooting involving two men. They haven't released the information of either of those men right now, a name or calls or anything, because they are still working on that. But as soon as we get more information, we'll be sure to let you know. We know you will. Emily, thank you. New this